what's up everybody I'm always drinking before I start a video for some reason when I hit the record button I drop my mouth dries out and it happens even when I'm making videos on my regular channel the only difference is over there you know I tend to edit it out over here I give you guys the realness you guys get a hundred percent realness on this channel speaking of realness this week is book week and man it doesn't get any realer than that, I guess. I don't read books anymore. I did when I was growing up um, in school and stuff because I had to. Uh, now when I read books, I download them on my phone and read them on my phone through a book reader. Or I read them online. Or, um, you know, I used to have this tablet. Um, and I used to download them onto a tablet and read them. But that thing is clunky. When it first came out, it was really cool and trendy. You know, you could download books to a tablet and read them on the tablet. But now it's just as easy to read them through my phone. And um, I guess I am so into, like, technology and stuff that I tend to stay away from, like, books. Um, but I do read some stuff. I read magazines. I love magazines, especially um, informative magazines about movies and, and video games and, you know, stuff like that. I get Game Informer in the mail every month. I read that. So I do read magazines. Does that count? Um, I'm not really big on thinking that you have to read books to be cultured. You know, I do a lot of other cultural things besides read books. I think it's more of a nostalgic thing. And um, if you enjoy it, then you should do it. But it's not really for me. You know, um, I prefer to just read online or read on my, my phone or, you know, you know, download it and, and, and convert it into something. <laughs> or watch it on a movie or a TV. Um, I actually did read a book, though, because my friend told me to read it. There's a movie that came out called Battlefield Earth that he, he insisted sucked horribly. And so he was like, read the book. The book's really good. The movie sucked, but the book's really good. So I took it, you know, upon him and, and went ahead and read it. And he was right. The book was better. And, um, you know, of course, a lot of the sci-fi novels I read when I was in school. But that's pretty much it. I'm not really a book person, really. Um, I can't sit down and do that. I feel like I could be doing something else. You know what I mean? I'm reading the book, and it's like I could be doing something, you know. Um, today's been really busy for me, too. Um, I don't want to ramble on too much, you guys, because last week's video was really long. Oh, oh, and the intro. You might wonder why I don't have an intro. I do have it. But it's in an um, Apple format, uh, MOV, and this program that I use, Minicam, only lets you um, use videos in... Windows formats, so uh, I had an option when I made when I'm making my video tonight was to say, okay, well I'm going to spend an hour fixing the uh, intro video, or I'm going to make a video for you guys and not make it really late at night. So I decided to go with the latter and just make my video because I'll get the intro done by next week. I'm sure you guys saw everybody's intro this week, and uh, thank you, Carlos, for taking the time to make those intros. Um, it's been kind of a long day for me. I've been booking a trip, my trip to Chicago that I was telling you guys about, and I've decided not to fly because I want to try something different. I have never been on a train before, so uh, we are considering booking a train ride from here to Chicago. And I know you guys are saying, why a train? Um, because I want to do it. I've never done it before, you know. I've never had a chance to go across the country on a train. So this is an opportunity for me to do something that's kind of fun. Plus, it's my birthday week. And um, I don't mind taking a day out to, to ride the train and get drunk on the train because they do have a lounge and a dining car. So, um, yeah, it's, in my mind, I'm thinking that's going to be pretty fun. Um, you know, it's, it's a little bit longer than driving, and it's a lot longer than flying, but it is an adventure. And I am always up for adventure. So that's what I'm thinking. And uh, it's always fun to do something that you've never done before. So that's how I'm looking at it. So it's a, it's a experience thing, I guess you could say. Plus, I take a lot of pictures. And that way I can actually upload stuff to YouTube and, and maybe even broadcast on blog TV while I'm on the train. Because I will have my laptop. And I connect it to my phone. So that will be a lot of fun. Um, I don't know if they have Wi-Fi on the train. I should probably look into that. I don't know. Anyway, it's another Thursday, and I don't know if I told you guys or not, but my name's Eric. I'm the Thursday Bear. Did I say that at the beginning, or did I not? I'm so scattered brain today, and I apologize. Um, anyway, what else did I want to talk about? Yeah, 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 yeah. Blog TV, all my links, Twitter, Blog TV, MySpace, 
Facebook, YouTube, all that stuff will be over here. Did it lock up? No, our browser lock up? No, it's still recording. YouTube, YouTube. Has anybody else noticed YouTube is just failing lately? My whole browser just like went. If you guys don't know, let me show you something. I'm going to show you something. This is what it looks like when you do a quick capture. So it's really basic. Let me uh see. Here's the interface. And um, it doesn't really give you many options to do anything. <laughs> so if it starts to freeze up or lock up, you're just screwed. And you know what? I said I wasn't going to make a video six minutes long because last week's video was six minutes long. Guess what? Ding, ding, ding. It's at six minutes. So I got to go. I'm out of here. You guys have listened to me talk enough. Go do something else. Go read a book or download a book or watch a movie or take a train trip cross country in the rain.